I don't want to talk about children's health care of Atlanta. I want to talk about sports. Right? <laughs> Let's talk sports. <laughs> All right. I think. Parker. <laughs> and then. Now, what's going on, Parker? What's up, my man? How are you doing, dude? <laughs> good, man. Good. Parker, when is, the, when is the first time we talked to Parker from Children's Health Care of Atlanta? Yeah. How many years ago was that? Do you remember how old you were? Uh, no. Goodness. I mean, at least six years ago, right? It might have been. It was a long time oh, ago, man. Yeah. yeah. It was a long time ago. I mean, yeah. It was that time when he invited you to the Hawks game and then yeah. uninvited you for somebody else. Right. He oh. uninvited me I and then a- invited <laughs> Brian Cameron, yes. if, I, if I remember correctly. Well, I will say he did. I bought him tickets to something and he was like, never again. Mom. Okay, I yeah. Oh, geez. <laughs> what happened? The biggest cheapskate you'll ever know. Did she get terrible seats? Are you nosebleed? They were so bad. Yo. Yeah. They were a little spoiled. We will they say. were so bad. They were not. Yeah. They were literally- What's up there, huh? Like, my dad was running gag. It's like, we could have literally said, behind the dream bench, we're like half of the price that mom spent on the on those crappy tickets. Park- I you, got, <laughs> you got soft somewhere, man. Because everybody's inviting Parker, like, onto the court, on the fields and stuff mm-hmm. like that. So now you've gotten soft, dude. So now when you get, like, seats like everybody else, you're like, ah, oh, GT. <laughs> How dare you. Bert Weiss, you can't say a word. That, yeah. that's, I'm right there with you. You are equally effect. soft, my friend. I assure you that you have been on more fields than I have. Who has, like, covered you? The, the Hawks have brought you in, right? Braves, Falcons, yeah. all of them? Yeah. Yeah. At one at one point or another. You're on the Auburn field recently too, right? Oh yeah. Yeah. Why would you ever kicked off of the Auburn field? Oh hey Bert, right. can I ask you a question about Maddie Post? Is she new? No. Maddie? She's not no, she's been here for years, man. Oh you're, you're hey, Parker. Parker. Yeah. Yes. Hello, Mrs. Post. I'm not part of the Bert show. <laughs> part, part of children's. <laughs> yeah, she's part of children's. Well, wait a second. Before we move on here, it's hard to keep up with you. Yeah. Why did you get I, I'm proud of you, but why did you get kicked off of Auburn's field? Long story, my man. So my husband, my husband teaches at Georgia State. So he actually had sideline tickets on the Georgia State bench. <laughs> yeah. And Auburn scored. And well, not, pa- no, not scored. Auburn not- scored. And Parker just took off towards the player. And Parker's <laughs> like, you can't go. And my cop was like, no, sir. And you see on the TV. like, And I was like, what? Like, Tell me where to go, copper? <laughs> I do it alone. <laughs> Georgia State almost won that game and almost upset Auburn, right? It was awful. Yo, that was amazing. It was awful. <laughs> Absolutely awful. Uh, well, we could talk about sports all day long with Parker. Um, Parker's joined us <laughs> because what? at what 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 what, 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 Tommy? Isn't it weird that Duke's only loss was to Charlotte? Isn't that weird? Isn't that, weird? that is weird. He, that is so weird. <laughs> He's happy. He's happy about that. He don't like Duke. Tommy hates Duke. But, he, but, his, wife, hate Duke. but his wife's a Duke fan. Yes. I know all this, man. You wow. remember all this. That is impressive. Steel trap, man. So, um, my man, how's that come? <laughs> so, Parker was um, in Children's Health Care of Atlanta when he was how old? Right, newborn. Born. He got yeah. transferred there when he was two days old. For two his first days murder old okay and refresh everybody's memory the reason why he was in children's health care of atlanta was what so he was born with high oh no congrats Parker. on the new gig my man Con- congrats on the new gig what are you talking about who who got a new job oh. Oh. Mo, uh, you, did you know you're you're hosting that show with jade who you oh. who used to host the playlist with jade my dude thank you brother i appreciate it yeah, man. Do you know how, how, did you know that do you know how scared you just had me because i'm always the last to know when somebody leaves the bert show <laughs> somebody tells me and then i find out i thought you were telling me like one of these guys got a job yeah, that's somewhere. weird my man it's weird that like when radio hosts leave they don't give they give the listeners no warning whatsoever. i know that <laughs> i will certainly okay, let you know okay, i appreciate yeah. you let me go on with your story so it's born <laughs> with a condition called hydrocephalus which is um fluid on his brain yep. Parker had three pounds of fluid on his brain. Like he literally, this is appropriate because of the time of year, but he looked like an alien almost. Like, I mean, you did. I'm sorry, but I mean, it was, <laughs> it was 
cute. I literally look like Sam Cassell. Because you know, because you know, <laughs> Sam Cassell looks just like. Anyone. I don't know who Sam Cassell is. I don't either. Oh, the basketball player? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Y'all, I think y'all know that. Y'all remember oh, Sam's yeah. falling out. Oh, I was not ready. That is funny. <laughs> I have oh, to say, I'm a How about them hogs no, with that no. almost, with that almost championship <laughs> run last season? We're not. They're going to do, they're going to shock the world this year, baby. Shock the world. Okay. Yes, sir. So, Oh, man. Two days old, he has three pounds of fluid, basically no brain. Oh, by the way, so, the your vocals <laughs> in that firework parody were amazing. Thank agree. you so yeah, much. And I totally it. agree. A, nu a finger, a nub finger is the worst. Okay, it's thank never you. Happened so to be, though. <laughs> happened to be, though. I know. So he has three <gasps> pounds of fluid, no brain, essentially, just millimeters of brain matter. So he goes, um, and I found out when I was pregnant that he had this. Um, and it was just kind of like, we don't know what it means for him. And so he gets transferred over to children's. Um, we have the most amazing brain surgeon in the world. He just has the best bedside banner and just, you just feel like he's taken care of. So he goes over and um, has a shunt put in at two days old to drain the fluid um, from, yeah, we can, to brain, drain the fluid from his brain. So then it was just kind of a waiting game, like how much of his brain was damaged um and as you can see god just really worked miracles um he should not be talking like he's talking uh, just he's brilliant he's super smart um he yeah god, he really has just been healed and we a hundred percent accredit it to well the lord and the health care, the, the care he got at Children's, because every little thing matters. Like mm -hmm. when they delivered him, exactly like when they did the surgery, like all of those little things had lasting effects and the team that they put together for his care was just spot on. Um, and then when he, as the fluid drained, his head compressed really quickly. And so it was super misshapen, like his bones fused together, like his head looked like this. So then he had a um, surgery at six months and nine months where they completely reshaped his head, like took out the bones, put them back together, um, all of that. So today I would say really his struggles are so common with nowadays just kind of mental health stuff with brain, mm -hmm. right? So OCD, ADHD, um, we, we don't like to talk, stop talking, um, anxiety. <laughs> Just kind of all the things that so many people are dealing God. with. Parker Isn't that just nice? Kind of it's kind of yeah. like in the overall scheme of things, it's kind of nice to have oh, yeah. the problems that it's everybody else has, right? It really did, is. did I tell you the story about about? Did I tell the virtual about the story about the nurse? Um, uh -oh. hey, uh, hey, Bert, you remember that year that you went that y'all went to Bert's big event that y'all had Bert's big adventures in Disney? Yeah, and of course. like you and you had the dude by the name of Sammy. Sammy, this is one of our Bert's big adventure like kids. He said like a knee all the time. Like a knee. That's Sam. Oh, That's Sam. Sam. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sam. I love you like um, a knee. So funny story. His his mom actually worked at Choa and he uh -huh. and she was and which which leads me to the I don't remember the story. You remember the you remember last December? Yeah. That's not a whisper. We can whisper. Yeah. 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 That's the loudest whisper. Ever. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, um, I was, um, so I'll, I'll let my mom. I'll, I'll let my mom give you a backstory of what I'm talking about, and then I'll. No, say you won't. What I'm <laughs> we don't no, believe won't. that. As soon as she starts telling us the backstory, you're going to say something else. <laughs> right. We had a three day. We were in the hospital in um, December yep. for Parker for about three days. Go ahead. Yeah. Apparently, I so I wasn't eating, which we just and. Um, long, long story. Okay, long story short, my my dad and sister got COVID. We had just got oh, we had no. just gotten a new bundle of joy, which y'all which which y'all will um which y'all will see soon. Not a baby. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, and then and then you met the nurse. Yeah, and the, so I was I was all nervous and I wasn't eating. So then we went to Chola, yeah, and then yada yada yada, met, and and then we met the nurse and yada yada yada, you know. <laughs> and it's Sam's mom who went on Bert's Big Adventure. So it all oh, yeah. comes full circle. Yeah. Shout out to Sam's Good. mom. Yeah. <laughs> Good for you for Maddie Post will that. probably know who I'm talking about, don't you, Maddie? I don't know all the nurses there, but I, I believe you. <laughs> you know, I there's there's a lot of nurses like, at Tulsa. I think I, I mentioned the bird show at the like to 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 the to said doctor and she mm -hmm. was like oh my, 
oh, my son Sammy went on the bird, like went on Bird's Big Adventures yeah. at Disney. Yeah. And then, and, yeah. And okay. so, and then connection made, you know? Yeah, connection <laughs> made. All right, so Parker, you got to tell us about this bundle of joy you got going on there that you want to introduce us to, because this is a really big deal. This is a really big deal. Potato, come. Did you say potato? Potato. Oh, toto. Oh, God. She said potato. I thought she said potato. I heard, I heard potato. I was like, best name. <laughs> well, I mean, maybe the dog's name is potato. Potato Tot. So many guess, words. Can you guess where the name came from? What, what is the what, name what again? Is toto. Toto. Okay. So, oh, Wizard of Oz. Is it? No, the band. The band. The band. The band. Sing us a line or two from any wait, wait, Toto explain, song. Parker. Wait, we gotta explain to people what Toto is. Their band. Is the no, oh, like, dog. Right, yeah, right, we're showing our dog. So people this are listening Parker. right now have no idea what's going on. There is a dog <laughs> on the me. screen, <laughs> and it's a service Sorry, dog. He's, he's a growler. Children. This one. He's a okay. growler. This one. So tell him what Toto is. Who Toto is? He's a service dog. For who? For me. So what's he gonna help you with? ADHD, anxiety, and yada yada yada. You know. <laughs> yada yada. He's a yada 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 dog. So when, like, when you say that he helps you with that stuff, when, like, he can feel your anxiety before, like, it gets. Well, Bad? We're working on it. <laughs> Apparent. So, like, the bad part about that is like the the organization that we got him from. That they believe that of, of like the handlers training the dogs, which is a pain in the buttuckus. Buttuckus. <laughs> <laughs> <Batuckus. laughs> <laughs> okay. So we got him as a puppy, and so it's a two to three year process before he's officially trained. So we go to training every Saturday for four hours. Just really fun and um do training and then he goes everywhere with us so he is he has all the rights of a service dog but he hasn't you know passed the test which doesn't he have won. his degree yet yes and so he's still he hasn't quite bonded to parker yet he Aww. thinks that i'm his his person so that's Aww. kind of where we are he's smooching him right now yeah, he does like <laughs> there's something <laughs> there there's and some, the ear connection there if he didn't see it he just licked me right in the ear <laughs> this is, I think it was the, the, the frontal lobe specifically. <laughs> so, so is Toto your favorite band, oh. Parker? Okay. Go. Yeah, yeah. I mean Toto and Queen. I would I uh, should have named you Freddie Mercury, which would have which would have made ten times more sense. You know, what a great name for a dog. No, Toto's Freddy cool. Mercury. I like Toto. Unless the rain down in Africa. Be a girl, he was gonna name her um Wendy Tanitra. Yeah, which <laughs> which y'all y'all know Wendy Adams? Former intern on the bird show. Yeah. I saw a video. And you remember that time that Wendy was crying about that video with the horses? I don't, you know? man. I don't remember that. It's on the YouTube channel. So he was okay. gonna name the her that from after and then, Wendy and Tanitra. On 90 to 9 the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know I listen to him all the time. It's gonna take a lot to drive me away Amazing. from you. There's nothing that a hundred men or more could ever do. I bless the rains down in Africa. Yeah. All right, so Children's Healthcare of Atlanta yeah. can do a lot of things, but they can't keep him on pitch. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that would, that sounded perfect to we're me. We're saying this is making miracles, but him being like right on pitch would be a miracle. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right, Parker, man, it is always good to talk to you every single year. I can't think of a more shining example. Okay, is this live, by the way? I was just about to like really play you up, dude. I'm right in the middle of like a really big emotional like payoff. What do you got? I mean, I don't know. <laughs> You're gonna interrupt my emotional payoff for that? Go, go on, my man. Go on. That's lost. I lost. I lost. Parker, you'll find it. You'll find it, Bart. I believe in you. All right, here's what I can say. The phone number, if you want to help out today, again, it's the Making Miracles Radiothon, 1-866-781-8811, or you can text the word MIRACLE to 64636. And if you want to do something a little bit more ambitious, and every month you want to donate, you can become a miracle maker, and you can do that by texting MIRACLE again, 64636, and we're asking for 15 bucks a month. 15 bucks a month, that's it. So when you text text miracle to 64636 you're going to get a text back and that's when you click the link and you fill out all your information we've made it super easy for you but just make sure to remember to click that link when you get that text back i am not sure anything happened over the last 10 minutes to anybody to say you know what i'm going to donate <laughs> <laughs> yeah you better 
better donate or I will I will have serious problems. Okay. <laughs> there it is. There it is. That's the and, tagline, baby. And that's what we do. Good job, Parker. Right. right on time. <laughs> you guys, thanks for joining us. Appreciate it. It's good to see y'all. See, see you guys. You Bye. The Bird Show. <laughs>